Hello, my unicorn squad. So I'm going to be doing a video of my craft room uh, updated tour. So this is what you see on my door when you enter. Reasons to be a unicorn, fart glitter, poop rainbows, live forever, can fly, look stunning, awesome horn you can stab people with. That was a gift from the sweet and lovely Dana at Constructing Artistics with Dana. Okay, so as you enter my room, I'll try and go slow because I don't have a tripod to set you guys up on. So as you enter my room, which there's the entryway, um, the first thing that's in here is... This is just like a catch-all. I have my sand, my decorative sand. I have some Velcro strips. I have bamboo skewers to make my um, flags. I have my wooden dowels and my big glue sticks and some tongue depressors. This is one of my memory decks boxes. This was made by Alicia Wagman. So that's one of my memory decks boxes. In here, I don't even know what's in here. It's just a whole bunch of random papers and stuff that I put away. Um, down here there's a journal. I'll try and go slow so that way you guys don't get dizzy. In here is another catch-all place. Sorry my dog was growling. Um, it's another catch-all place. I have my um, Sizzix sidekick there. I have some acrylic paints, some stuff for Happy Mail, some um, crepe paper, some craft bond glue, some glitter, this has some die cuts in it, this has some die cuts in it. And then we got some glitters back here. And we work our way up. We got my unicorn mug with a whole bunch of trims in it. Um, here are some trims in here and ribbons. All three of them have trims and ribbons in them. My mermaid tail here is just some like jewelry pieces in here we got some glitter mixes that I got from a friend I have my glitter pieces here I have all my washi tape on this um, it's a um, a curtain rod then we go up slowly and I'll give you a view of it um, here I have another memory decks box my glass that I got from Target in the States um, some wands that I got in Happy Mail. My unicorn, some more washi tapes. Then you work your way up. I can back up and give you the full view. It's my craft, it says my craft room, and I put some unicorn decals. This is my hoard board, as I call it. Um, my ATG guns up there. Here we have a painting I did, some of my merch that was made for me. Over here, we have this, um, it's actually a table or a kitchen cloth, you know, like a drying cloth. It says, roll me a berry, doesn't call me unicorn, so I framed it. Um, I got some cards. My first ever pocket letter swap that I did. Okay, so in here we have, it's hard for me to open, it's just my Alice in Wonderland box that I got from Orlando to Sony in a swap, an Alice swap we did. Um, it's full with flowers and stuff like that. In this drawer, it's a catch-all. It has like some napkins for decoupaging. A whole bunch of different random things in there. And warn you, they are messy. This is all my washi tapes. This is just unraveled. That's why it looks messy. But I got a lot of washi tapes in there. Okay. Garbage over there. Um, in this drawer here, we have washi tapes, we have E6000, these are my oils for my oil diffuser, a whole bunch of washi tapes, some little random trinkets, these are glass jars that I use to make sequin mixes, here's some little beading, uh, we have some wood pieces in here, little stationery kits. Highlighters, pencils, just stuff I can grab at. And then in this drawer, warn you, it's messy. 
It's all my extra stickers that I need to just stash because I don't use. Oh, I love this one. Love it. But I got to go through that. Sorry about that mess. And again, this drawer is just for packaging. So it is a huge mess. It's got like packaging stuff. Um, I save all the shred from packages to reuse. Okay. Then we go down here and we have all my Disney books to make in Femra. So down here, we got some Wonder Woman ones. In this one, oh wait, we'll start here. Got my Paris lamp, a cup full of pens. Then these are my perler beads for making enamel dots. And tip, use new perler beads, don't use old. And 350 degrees for 15 to 20 minutes. In this top piece, we have, sorry about the shakiness, we have the color block box, then I have a whole bunch of wooden stamps that I barely use. This is all my wood stamps. Actually, I have a, I don't know where it is, but I have a big unicorn one that I use. Up oh, here it is, of course, because, you know, it's a unicorn, so I use that one. So that's that. Has some Christmas ones that I'll probably use this year that I paid three dollars at the Dollarama. Okay. Next drawer, I have some stickers that I use almost on every package that I send out. <clears throat> Down here is another catch-all. It's just got junk, random junk, extras. Okay. Now, starting at the bottom of my desk. Um, I have, these are my six by eight inch, eight and a half inch paper pads, or no, six by eight, sorry. And, oops, these are my six by sixes. Up here we have my Tim Holtz paper cutter, my guillotine. Um, these are some books that I use. I don't actually cut this Wonder Woman up because it was expensive. I cut this Alice one up, I cut this Alice one up. Um, this is a book full of poems that I read. Then, down here, we have some adult coloring books. Um, here we have the Halloween paper collection that I got in a, a rack. And then I have some Duotangs here, an Alice book, and some more little paper pads. Um, here I have another Alice in Wonderland book that I got from a friend. And then Miss Marty's tag that I gotta find a spot for. Then I have some tubes of washi. In here I have some Christmas cards out and ready. In here I have, um, like journaling cards that I send out in Happy Mail. This is more random die cuts. Sorry guys, let me just put things back as I go so I don't mess up the room. In here I have, let me stand, in here I have all my distressed inks that I go for on a daily, daily basis, okay. Here I have a distressed oxide ink, and then as we go up here, I have my dog's toys, um, my dog's horn for Lucy Horn. These are all my clear stamps that I use on a daily basis. I did these stash some, um, some inks, a whole bunch of inks here that I use. This is an empty jar that I have to find a place to put something in. Here is another catch-all of stuff I grab on a daily basis, like some ephemera pieces, some... Because I do plan. I have a happy planner. So there's that. Like stuff for happy planners. And now if we look up. I have this banner that I got from a sweet friend. Hello Abril. Um, a Wonder Woman book. I got that unicorn from Abril. That from Abril. All for my birthday last year. So thank you Abril. Um, here's my Alice in Wonderland melting clock. A few things that I got in some Happy Mail and swaps. And then this is what you guys see on a daily basis. Don't mind that pop can. 
is my Tim Holtz mat. That's what you guys view on. And I have a banner here from my challenge last year. And if you look up, it's not too pretty. I have all my glues and my distress sprayer. And this is what I actually film on. So it's all the way to the ceiling hooked up. So you guys are stable. And I use a selfie stick. So what I did is I just screwed it in to these two wood planks. And this is my old desk. This pair of scene is my old desk. Um, I just put it as a wall hanging. Um, down here, I actually have all my scraps. And this was, I was doing a live video and it was pixelated. I was doing a live craft room tour. So these are my perler beads melted down into enamel dots. These are all my scraps that I got to go through in this gorgeousness of a box. So I'm just going to put that back in here. In here I have all my die cuts. Not all of them, mind you. There's die cuts in here that I got. This pouch came from Orlando to Sony. These are some of my die cuts that I store just below me that I use a lot. And if we go over here, starting at the bottom, we have my paper trimmer. In here, we have my dog's feet prints that I keep in there because I don't want them breaking. And then we have these gorgeous Alice in Wonderland pieces that I have not used because I love them. Miss Orlando Tassoni gave me these in a swap we did. Look at how gorgeous those are. I don't want to use them. Because I'm an Alice in Wonderland fan. Um, in here I have just some chalk, chalkboard, um, cardboard pieces. In here I have my backup of sequins that I had gotten in swaps and Happy Mail and stuff like that. That they're all packaged. I just keep them like this so that way if I need to grab them and I run out of a certain filler, I can just come down to my little station and get some because you know me with my sequins I'm always doing something with sequins here we have um, Maggie Holmes chipboard confetti that I purchased from Dana I construct artistics with Dana that she was so nice enough to go and buy me at her Tuesday morning okay sorry guys about this video quality but I don't have a tripod here we have LOL collection here, some white 6x6 card stock, my black card, my colored card. Um, here are these books. They're Mambi sheets and they're like almost like wrapping paper magazine material. Um, here I have my white card stock. It's tight so it's hard to get into. Um, this BB Craft glitter card stock, some chipboard pieces. Here we have all of my card stock. Here I have my big scoreboard, my slang book, my um, stamp press, whatever you call it. <laughs> I'm not too sure. And then let me pause you. Going up into my three drawers that I have. Um, I have all my paper trimmers, okay, and these are all organized cabochons, okay, we got some pom-poms and some bows, um, some more cabochons and pom-poms, more cabochons, more cabochons, some trims, pom-poms, pom-poms, some bookends that I use for my albums. Some glitter diamond pieces. More pom-poms that I lost the lid for. So that's all that's in that drawer. This next one, we have my foam mounting tapes. And then just some little tools. And there's that lid for my other one. We have my Nuvo drops. And this is... Um, scribbles paint and then we have some recollections whoops recollections um, glitter glue 
This is actually rubber cement, some little diamond pieces, um, some more paint, some uh, binder clips for my planners when I make them, like traveler's notebooks, some more paint that's not supposed to be down there. Sharpener, a big bone that I use to make dog things with. A screwdriver, a uh, backup glue gun that leaks all over the place. Some library cards, some extra daubers. And then in this top drawer, if it stays open without falling out, I have all my paper clips. Right? So I got all my paper clips back there. All my sequins mixes that I use. Some embossing powders, um, my spoons that I use to scoop out my mixes, and here I have some pearls, a whole bunch of sequin mixes, and these are actually not sequin mixes, they're um, diamonds. Sequin mix, these are all sequins except this here, my cabochons. Some more sequin mixes, so that's it for that. Then we go up here, we have this, these little plastic um, jars with pom-poms in them because I like the pastel -y colors, so I use it for decoration. These drawers are hard to open. We have in here like some Wonder Woman trinkets, some clothespins that I got from Miss Marty, just like metal pieces that can be used. And in here are all my sponges, extra sponges. This is a dauber that I, or a squeezy thing that I use to make droplets for water. And this one's hard to open. It's got magnets, removable foam dots. Um, the picture that was made by the lovely Susie Tootsie Tucker of my dogs. And then we have some tags. I think I showed you this, my glue section. Here I had this made. Um, this was from Miss Marty. And then this is a chart of all my markers, my um, alcohol markers. Then down here I have this tape, my old tacky glue. I have back here my diamond dust and some more glitter. And a MAC lipstick for some reason is just sitting out and about. Um, some more um, filler, some sequin mix, and some baker's twine, and then some charms back here. Um, here's my pen that I sign out all my videos with. Um, down here we got some toe tags, some binder clips, and then this Wonder Woman stamp that I got from Miss Marty. Thank you. Um, over here we have my rotating... Um, tool organizer. We have some straws. These are actually glue dots that I found at the Dollar Tree that I never knew they had. My heat gun, my fuse tool, my Tim Holtz scissors, my alcohol markers, some of them. Hot glue gun, that's amazing hot glue gun. I love it. Um, then we back up. Let me just pause. So we're, now we're backed up. This is what I'm going to show you next. We have all this. This is from um, Happy Mail, Swaps and all that. And then I got my unicorns. Um, that looks like my dog, so I kept that up. This says, today I'm a unicorn, tomorrow I'll be a mermaid. Then we come over here. That's my dog's bed, don't mind them. And then I have this TV stand that I just added as another extension of my desk because my desk starts here and I wanted it kind of like an L shape. So I painted it and put some zebra print. Um, um, I forget what they call it. But we walk over here. I'll show you up here. It's my little unicorn pastel mint tin. The hot air balloon I made, a little bubble gum machine. Some random stuff. Some sequin mixes. Here I have my unicorn, my pink Christmas tree, some more little sequin mixes. Um, that was made by Abel Martinez 
my birthday. We have some stuff up here. Um, this shirt I got down in Clearwater, Florida. I have some tags, a book. And then we have my Sizzix Big Shot and some Tim Holtz items I'm yet to do. That is a gorgeous album, well, journal from the lovely Timbera Lily Crafts. And this is a little jewelry form that I used for my washi tapes. And this is another catch-all for, like, different types of things like stickers and all that. Here is one of my expensive purchases, but I did need it. I have two of these. Um, this cost $25.99. Um, this is Maggie Holmes collection and like unicorns and stuff and all my die cuts. Here I have just a thing I painted and put my Sharpies in. A whole bunch of Sharpies. This is my bead making kit that I got from BB Craft. And we go down here. This is a card from Miss Marty. This strong word I got in a swap. These are some things I made. Um, my unicorns, some albums, my laminate and create sticker thing. Um, this is These two unicorn boxes just have stuff in them. Here is another one of my... Excuse me, Rocky. Another one of my um, die cut sorters. Okay. And it has, these ones aren't labeled, but like this is Christmas. We have, um, don't know. This is just random. This is Halloween. Um, this is like travel. Um, that's embellishments. This is like summary. Here we have birthday. Here we have Alice in Wonderland. This is, these are some doilies. These, this is the, um, open book collection that I got from Dana. Some more tags and ephemera. Again, that's the chipboard collection from Maggie Holmes. And here we have a whole bunch of floral pieces. And down here, this is like all my, these are good to have too. And you can see I like pink and mint. Um, this is all my um, like stuff to make embellishments and all that stuff. Look. Over here, okay, we have this basket, and I just have, like, Maggie Holmes stuff, stuff that I use on a daily basis when I'm crafting. Okay, this was an album made for me by Paper to Masterpiece, and it lights up. Why is it not lighting? Oh, there she goes. Um, I have a little box here full of some fabrics. This is full of like floral pieces that was made for me by Miss Marty and then here I have a whole slew of craft books that I use okay and down here I have my enchanted creation labels that my mom made this is all my Christmas and Halloween because I don't have room for anywhere else this is just all packaging and some books. And then this is my albums that I made. Um, you've seen that album in my first Christmas collab video. And my unicorn album. And that is my Alice in Wonderland. Um, I can show you what's in it really quick if it comes out easy enough. This is my Alice in Wonderland lunch bill. Sorry guys, this is all over the place with all my decorative scissors that I don't even gravitate to anymore. Okay. Mm, little pouches. Um, I showed you all that, so let's move along. Now, leaving this section behind, we're going to my Rascog. That's in the color mint. So we will start down here. I have 
There's Cloud that I got from Tabera Lily. We have all my um, tools that I use in this mint bucket. These are some trims that I use um, in here. In the second part, these are all things that I received in swaps, embellishments, and stuff like that. Um, like it goes all the way back. And some I have made in here like that are ready to go. If we move up to this top piece, I have some uh, magnets. And I just bought this. This holds all my Distress Crayons and my alcohol markers that didn't fit in the other one, my Copic. Um, then in here, I have, this is all planner related stuff pretty much for my Happy Planner. So I can reach and grab. Um, then we back up and I have my mannequin. Okay, and then my nice little curtain rod and my pillow and then over here it's just got some of my wrapping paper my slippers and my christmas tree that i set up in here and then of course my Sizzix big shot machine and then my closet so that is it for my craft room tour um i hope you enjoyed and i'll give you a nice little pan of it again slowly okay if i back up maybe that'll work better Okay, again, as to not make you dizzy, and until my next upload, you know what to do. Stay magical. Bye.